Hey y'all, I'm back with another journal with me and this is my fourth day of my 100 days of Bible promises. I am starting with uh, my favorite tools which are circle punches. I have a variety of sizes probably ranging from about an inch to maybe two inches. Um, so I have like one inch, one and a quarter, one and a half, and probably it goes straight to two because I don't think I have a one and three quarters, which I wish I did. Um, but if you, I will also link dies down below because normally those nest really well, which means they have tons of sizes and they're probably about like maybe a quarter of an inch, maybe even less than that, like apart. And so um, I'll try to link everything down below. And if I can't find these exact punches, which normally I can't because I got these a long time ago, I normally, I normally link something similar. So I'm just starting with um, using those uh, circles that I've punched out of this pattern paper to kind of just make kind of a confetti or a big confetti look around the page and I am hanging some of them off the edge because I think that looks really finished and um, I've done this a lot with scrapbooking pages and honestly circles is like they're perfect when you are in kind of a rut and you're not really sure what to do I wouldn't say I was like in a creative rut at this point but I I really didn't know um, what I was going to do for this particular page and I was like well I haven't done um, circles yet or I haven't used my circle punches uh, that I know of. I don't think I have and so I decided to pull those out and use those and I always think circles make everything look better. Um, so I also added a couple of um, uh, pl not plastic what am I saying clear stickers to uh, well I think I maybe added just one for now no I added more than that I added a few from the happy planner some floral stickers and then I and I just tucked those kind of around the circles and then I also added um, one at the top left hand corner that says hello today and um, I pulled some more of those circles because I did a project a while back not a while back probably a couple weeks ago um, and I had a lot of leftover circles so I pulled some more because I did feel like it was lacking in some areas and now I'm I'm grabbing these creative devotion stickers and I love those I want more of them um, but those are kind of those are clear as well and I'm just using them to just accent some pages or some parts of my page Now I have these crepe paper stamps from the Oasis collection and uh, I'm going to use those to spell out and know that I am and then I'm going to use a different stamp set for the word God. Now I couldn't find um, these actual stamp sets or these actual stamps because they are, I think they're sold out or they're unavailable or discontinued and so I'm going to try to link some that are similar to this outline stamp that I was using. And the last thing that I'm doing is adding some of these Tim Holtz um, tiny word stickers and I'll link those down below as well and I just love I I could add those to every single project that I do just because I love the kind of pop of um, either white or black that they give and then I also um, just think like the typewriter text makes everything look better so that is my process I hope you guys enjoyed it it was super simple but I um, hope you get you guys get some inspiration for your pages talk to you guys soon bye